So you see, his love is not conditional, but the benefits of it are, well, what does that mean? What that means is, is that so many of us rob our own self of enjoying the benefits because we're not willing to live obedient, bold lives. He, 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 didn't, he didn't save us. I want you to listen to this. He didn't save us so that we might live these, these, these little mealy mouth sissy kind of lives. He didn't call us to be sissies. He called us to be bold as a lion in our faith. He didn't call us to be a people that's running around worried about, oh, I hope they're not offended about this, and I hope they're not offended about this, but a people who would stand up in love and boldly proclaim, Jesus Christ is Lord of all. That's who we're called to be. And we're wondering why, why our, our, our country is in the shape that it's in. We're wondering, and men, we're mad about the fact that Christ isn't in the schools and why Christ isn't in the White House and why Christ isn't in the courthouse. It may be because we're not sure we want him in his own house or in our house. We are called to be a people boldly to stand up and say, I'm pledging my love to another. I'm giving my life to another. I am his and he is mine. I will serve no other. 